Hi guys, Glory Hunter back with a special, very special video. Um, this is Gareth from the Man Caves. Uh, I think it was 500 subscriber competition. Um, he nominated me to be the winner of said competition and has sent me a kind of loot crate box um, for winning. So, first of all, massive. Thank you, Gareth. This is, you know, really appreciated. It's just a nice gesture for the community. I know he's done a couple of these um, competitions uh, in the past. I think the last one, I was called Garage Face one, and he had some pretty decent stuff in that as well. I've spoken to Gareth a few times. Uh, we talk fairly regularly, and he said he's put some stuff in here that should suit me. Um, so yeah, I've no idea what's in it. Really looking forward to opening it. We've got Resident Evil 2 uh, playing on the PlayStation in the background. I know we're, we're both looking forward to the remake of that. It's one of his favourite games. Uh, so put it on as an homage of your mate. Um, so yeah, let's find out what's inside. Um, and before we do a little fraction of knife at you, a uh, uh, letter opener, not a lit knife at all. Um, yeah, if everybody on my channel should already know Gareth and his channel. If not, obviously go over and check him out. I'll put his uh, link in the description uh, for you anyway. But yeah, go check out Gareth's content. Uh, great asset to the community and just good content. So yeah, go check out Gareth's channel. Anyway, let's find out what's inside. So with my letter opener, I will uh, try and open this up. I'm not sure if this is a, a letter on top or... Oh, okay, yeah, it's a piece of paper that's just kind of just curing all the details. Can't wait to replay this. I've done quite a bit of um, Resident Evil 2 remake. Uh, videos and stuff, so obviously if you're interested in that as well Like I say, go check now It's struggling to get in it. There's a whole lot of sellotape and stuff in this Okay, I do know one item that's in here because he did ask me for the uh, check the size on it and um, So it was kind of a little bit in the picture So here we are we are open Wow, this has a lot of stuff in it. So, I'll show you the uh, the top of the box. It's absolutely run with stuff. I think that was a letter. Okay, so, let's have a look at the letter. I'm going to browse through it just in case. Yeah, okay, so, Dear Glory Hunter Hates 2, Scott, that's me. For those of you that don't know, because I've never really mentioned my name. Uh, thank you for the support for my channel and the great things you're doing for the retro gaming community on YouTube. Uh, this loot box is full of random gaming related stuff which includes a new Sony PlayStation t-shirt. That's the item I knew about because uh, he obviously wanted to check the size it'd fit. Um, enjoy the man cave, Gareth. So yeah, thanks for this mate. Let's uh, delve in, shall we? There's all kinds of stuff in here. We have a... I don't want to say bandana, no, oh, hey, oh, it is a Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, and I think that, if I'm not mistaken, is a bandana, or you could turn it into a bandana, if not, it is just a cloth, um, nice piece of artwork, um, but yeah, that's pretty cool, that will look good either up, or if I could turn it into a bandana, I do well with my short hair in the sun, so we'll see what we can do with that. Um, that's pretty cool. That's just so much stuff, I don't know where to start. Okay, we have a Xbox 360 version, I think some demo discs and stuff. Sounds pretty cool. Let's have a look across the discs here. So we've got two discs. One disc, a disc. Um, Sounds Creed Brother on here to reach, available for 3 Melibon for 311. Ah, oh, volume 60 and volume 61. Uh, Black Ops, Split Second, Dead Space 2, Metal of Honor, and Halo Reach. 
So a couple of 360 demo discs. I did collect my demo discs as well. Pretty cool. Singularity on there as well. Great game. Really hidden gem if you've not checked that out. Then we have, oh my god, so much stuff. Uh, okay, this is the Princess Peach McDonald's toy. Spins around. I'll be going on the shelf. There is a. It's a Harley Quinn. Now these are. I forget the special name for it, but like the mini mini mysteries minis of Harley Quinn. I do like my uh, Batman and that kind of stuff, and even have. You may have seen it on my movie shelf with my kind of DC Marvel superhero movies, a load of like Batman figurines and stuff. So that'll be going on there. Cheers, mate. That'll look pretty cool. We have, and I actually need this. I want this. It is a copy of Colin McRae Rally 2 on the PlayStation Platinum version. But we do need this in the collection. So that is an absolute stellar um, prize in there. I do like my Colin McRae uh, games. Some of the best rally games uh, on any system, in my opinion. Next we have a Luigi figure, one of the old McDonald's toys, so he will join Princess Peach on the shelf. There is loads of stuff in it, this is crazy. There is a pin badge from, yeah I thought it was, Payday 2. It's one of the masks. Nice little pin badge, I've mentioned, I do collect badges as well, and a gaming related badge at that cannot go wrong. That is awesome. It's a nice metal shiny one. <clears throat> right, there's a couple of discs on this side of the box. Let's get through these because there's a load of stuff underneath. We have a copy of Halo 2 on the obviously on the OG. All complete there. It's nice. Right, so let's put these down here. A copy of the thing on the OG Xbox. Obviously, I'm going for that full OG. Right, after a few choice swear words, uh, we're back. I apologise, I did not want to do a break in this video. I wanted to run it all the way through, but the camera just stopped recording. I don't know if it's overheated or what. Um, and it didn't have much record time left on there for some reason, even though it was a new memory card. I took it out, it was red hot, and put a new one in. Hopefully we should be good now to go for the rest of the video. I swear I haven't peeked in the box, I put it down, just got a new thing. So hopefully we can carry on, I do apologise. Especially to you, Gareth. Anyway, I think we got to here. It was the thing on the OG Xbox. I was saying, um, go for a full set. So it's nice to have his full, full set in there. So that is great. Cheers for that, mate. Nice couple of OG titles there. Um, there is another stack of discs and demos here, I think. So we have 360 demos again. So it looks like there's a decent set here. Let's flick through these. There's another one. I think the numbers are on the discs. So I'll look through that. Is all three footage on that one? Edge three DSC. Videos of all kinds of stuff on there, so I'm just absolutely taken away by the amount of stuff that's in this box. <laughs> just things rushing in my head, they're just not verbally coming out. Um, yeah, it's great. Like, I don't have any of these discs, so this is absolutely fantastic. There's loads, absolutely loads in here. It's crazy, mate. Two. Trying to show you and look what's in here at the same time. Absolute tons. Loving it, mate. Absolutely loving it. It's fantastic. It's Community stuff on here as well, reviews and extras. All 
our last couple here. There we are. So there's a load of 360 demos for me to have a blast through and have a look at. Um, we've got loads of stuff in bags here. Got a little got it in. That's a little figurine. That's pretty cool, actually. He's doing like a, a flying sidekick. That's pretty cool. I'm going to be honest. I don't know what the character is. I don't know if he's a... It sounds stupid, but a Pokemon or something. But that's pretty cool. I like the, uh, the pose on that one. And there is another one. There. He's back. We have another one of the little uh, mini pop things. I can't think what they're called. I don't think they're mini mini pops. They do have a special name. I'll probably put, put it down here when I find out. And it's escaping me who that is as well. It's like another superhero. Oh, wicked. We have another one and we have Batman. I mean, he's absolutely going up on that shelf. That's quite my favourite superhero. I think I have mentioned that before. It is pretty cool. Badass. We have another flying psychic dude. We have, oh wow, we got a, a Thor little mini guy. He's pretty cool. You like my Marvel? You like my Thor? New film's amazing. It actually comes out to buy on my birthday on the 14th of August. That's pretty awesome. Got a couple of wristbands, not for resale, from Dragon is that Fighter Z? Not Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, Dragon Ball Z. Not Dragon Ball Z. Obviously. Two little uh, armbands. Not for resale, so I'm not sure what they uh, may have come with. They're pretty cool. So much stuff. I think that's a, a slip there. I think that came in at the Pulp mm. Grey game. Oh, we have another figurine. Yeah, I think these are Pokemon looking at that. That's a pretty badass cool thing. That will go on the shelf as well. I do like my little shelf fillers. We have a Sonic the Hedgehog something or another, I think. I think it's a tissue. Um, they are staying sealed. It's a Sonic the Hedgehog kind of packed tissue. It has got some uh, kanji writing on the back. Japanese, Chinese, I couldn't tell you. I'm not sure. But that's pretty cool. That's a nice little um, bit of game and memorabilia. Oh wow, we've got some, we've got some cards. Some trading cards. A load of Pokemon trading cards. That's pretty awesome. We've got a black and white boundaries across sampling pack with three cards. We have a black and white emerging powers sampling pack with three cards. Um, another another one of those. I think a couple more actually. Yeah, another another three of those. So five of those ones all together. Then we've got some Sun and Moon Burning Shadows uh, packs with 10 additional cards in each. A couple with Ho Ho Han and one with, you know what, I don't even know who that is. But there's an Pokemon on that one. They're awesome. I will probably open them in a second. That's nice to have. It's all nice to have. So sorry for the interruption again guys, but I just wanted to show you what was actually in these cards. So we're going to open them live and then you can get back to your video. So we'll start with this packet here. So it's got three samples in. I was having my window open, so I apologise for any uh, extra sounds. It's just too hot to have it closed. So we have a trainer potion. Uh, Oshawott, not seen that one before, and a uh, Patrat, 
This is a gen I'm not familiar with yet. So we have those three there. I've never actually played the actual card game of Pokemon. So it'd be interesting to see if with all these cards I can actually have a game. I'll have to have a look into it. So in this one we have a ducklet. Ooh, if it'll focus. We've got Ducklet. I don't even know how to say that. Darumaka. And a Cubcho. Cho. Cho. I don't know. There we are. There's that one. I love cracking new packs of cards, no matter what it is. Something about it. So, in this one we have... Okay, we've got some new ones. Mulga. I'm going to butcher these names. Pansir. And a Vullaby. That looks pretty cool. What are the cards here? Okay, oh wow, more new ones. It's nice that they're all different. Rug and Roller. <laughs> Sandile, that's pretty cool. And it. Gothita? Goth, yeah, I think. Oh, no duplicates yet, so that's always good. Hansage. Joltik, it's pretty cool. Swaddle, maybe. Not sure what gen this is classed as. Okay, we've got Gothia again. Is that the same one? It's a different, different artwork. Once it's a different card. Sandal, so that's it, I do. And Swallow again. That looks different as well. It is different. So it's an actual different card. So what's the... Uh, what's that one different? No, I think that one's the same. So we've got one. One the same. So far. In those packs. So now we're on to our Sun and Moon packs. We have one of these ones. So these contain 10 cards, I believe. Now, here's a familiar one that I know Porygon. So, I do know Porygon. Looks like a knitted fish. Tranamo. Maril. I know Maril. It's a knitted one again. Hootoot. I know that. Rhyhorn. I know that's a pretty cool one. Oh, wow, it's shiny. Simisage? Sage? Shiny one either way, that's pretty cool. Passimian? Got some yellow energy. Trainer Whip. Trainer Wishful Baton. And uh, Ribombi? I'm not sure, I don't know where the rare ones is. that class is the rare one? I don't know how Pokemon cards work with their. Rarity, some else I need to check. Just opening magic cards. Okay, I've seen already we've got, I think, another Hoot Hoot. So we have a Hoot Hoot, another Rhyhorn, a Rolts, that's pretty cool. I like Rolts. Tangler, he's pretty cool, I do like Tangler. Another one of those. Uh, shiny again, so maybe you just get shiny in every pack. The middle one's probably the rare. Another Pan Sage. Weevil, that's pretty cool. Dark Energy, Charmeleon, nice. A Rhydon, that's pretty cool. I like that one. And a Noctowl, so the Hoots Evolution. And our last pack. Thanks again, Gareth, for these. 
toys interesting toy pin Sneasel which was the uh, previous one before the evolve of uh, what's it called or just Weevil that's it so oh Charmander wow nice that's Bruce from our Charmeleon we've got a Crab Brawler a Meowth Stuffle a Wishful Bat in this time Holograph one Shiny Electrovere, it's a new evolve, it's pretty cool. Red Energy, Gloom, no Gloom. Lunatone, I know, that's pretty cool. And Ewick, Trainer again. So, yeah, some nice cards there. Only, I think, two or three duplicates, so that's uh, nice to have. So, I'm going to have a look at these cards and maybe even learn to play the game for once. An actual card game. So, cheers, Gareth, and I'll let you continue with the video. Oh, wow, what is that? got a Tekken comic. Didn't even know these were a thing. I do have a few comics. Issue 1. Titan Comics. It's a heck yeah. Wow. Oh, well, nice. So, from Cobble, we've got a few uh, character profiles. So, quick scout through. So I follow in maybe, yeah, Nina Williams, Anna Williams is in there, We've got Paul, Kuma, not Kuma, Panda, come in, sorry, I'm not even showing you guys, just immersed, look at that, That's nice, nice artwork, awesome, definitely going to have a read through this in a bit, Shall we? Quick flip through, don't mind me. Yeah, that is that's pretty awesome. I've not seen that before. That'll go with my other comics and stuff. We have some PlayStation uh, stickers. They're nice. With uh, maybe your world playing arts power. Some nice PlayStation stickers. They look like the ones that you can probably peel and peel back on. I'm not sure. They're pretty cool. We have the t-shirt at the bottom of the box. This is a nice t-shirt. It's got all kind of PlayStation, original PlayStation controllers all over it. I do like my gaming tees. There we are. Get my face in it, or you want to see my face? So yeah, that is a nice t-shirt. I've not seen that before. That's pretty cool. Proper license, official license, Sony product. All the controllers on, so that will probably be worn in my next video. I would have worn it in this one. And I opened the box, but I wanted it to be all a surprise. So that's awesome, mate. That is our loot crate uh, open there. Really like that t-shirt. I was going to wear my uh, Resident Evil hoodie as well, but it's far too hot for hoodies. Um, so again, Gareth, mate, that is absolutely amazing. I'll message you in a bit um, as well to let you know. Obviously, you'll have that message way before this video comes out. Um, you know, look down and edit this. So it'll be a couple of weeks. Like I said, last week I did the car boot one. Even though I'm filming this on the same day, it's why I'm wearing the same stuff. Um, it's, it's come out the week after. So I'll have chatted to Gareth before this video comes out. But I do want to say again, mate, massive thank you. Some pretty decent cool stuff there. Stuff for the shelf. Definitely, obviously, the demos for the collection and stuff. Um, so, yeah, it means a lot that you you picked me out. Like, I was in quite a bit of shock when, when he did tell me. Um, it's just nice that it's, I don't know, what I do has kind of been appreciated. It's I've never really thought about what I do, if that makes sense. You know, I just... Come down, get in front of a camera, lose in focus, show what I have, talk about games and my hobby and stuff, as do many, many other people. Um, so, yeah, it, it just means a lot to have been picked out and nominated to, nominated word for being given this uh, amazing gift. Uh, so, thanks, mate. And like I say, anybody who hasn't already, go over and check out Gareth's channel. Um, yeah. Hit in the comments um let him know how much it's appreciated. Everybody give Gareth some uh, 
nice comments and stuff there as well. Hit a like if you've enjoyed this, guys. Um, I've really enjoyed opening it and just being surprised. Yeah, it's, it really is fantastic. I don't know what else to say. There's, there's not more. Shall I have a chat with Gareth in a bit? Um, yeah, means a lot, mate. Means a lot. So, uh, yeah, stay tuned for future videos. And I'm looking forward to seeing what comes from Gareth as well. I know he's having a little bit of a break, I think, at the minute. I don't know if he'll be back by the time this video comes out. Uh, but looking forward to more of your stuff, mate. And, uh, yeah, we'll speak soon. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers, guys.